it's, it's, it's the people freaking, out there are purple, guys. <laughs> Yeah, it's fucking hot. The fucking sun has it's no fire, chill. Though. It's fire. I, it's I, a I desert, fuck, desert. I was, no, it's like it's, Guerrero is fire, dog. I yeah, fuck with it's Guerrero fucking heavy. like it's full of fucking culture, bro. Like you, you, I've I've done the drive from Uruapan yeah, food, tell, tell to Ixtapa. My family. <laughs> no, not your family, bro. <laughs> and in Guerrero, food they have like ra- roadside like coconuts and lobsters. Yeah, fresh. Really? Like you. Nowhere in the world can you buy a coconut and a maybe a, maybe you can but and a lobster, bro, fresh. fresh. Like, wow! Shout out to Mexico one time, dog. Oh, God, Mexico has everything. Man. I fucking yeah, love yeah. Mexico, coast coast. dog. Fuck yeah! There's there's no better place. Best food, best pedas. Best, best pedas, beer. bro. Like there's like in in Acapulco, there's like a place where there's Mar Abierto, which is like open sea, like like wild sea, and then like right next to it, like is a strip of land. And then right next to it is a lagoon. You know what I mean? Okay. So, like, you get there and then you ask for, like, oh, can I get some fish? And they go fish it in the, in the sea. But if you want, like, crabs and shit, like, they go to the lagoon. And everything's cooked fresh, like, right there. See? You, you know see? what I'm saying? You see? What FDA? Yeah, like, fuck. what fucking... Uh, is this FDA approved? Yeah, fuck yeah, that, bro. Fuck this is here. La Ciencia de Dios, and that's it, dog. You know what I mean? You're gonna get sick, but it's gonna be fire. Everybody has combis, combis. Yeah, like the, fuck out of here, like get the fuck, bro, get the fuck out of here, dog. That's you're, a van, right? Yeah, like I, I'm van? just thinking about like all my memories of, as a kid. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, dog. Speaking of, me- I've been, I've been to uh, my favorite place in Mexico is probably oh. Ensenada. Yeah, I got you. Fucking love Ensenada to the day I die. Fucking! I was just about to ask you about Baja California. La Bufadora. I love Baja California, dog. I took a cruise one time to um, La Bufadora because it was the cheapest one. Yeah. I took me, my mom, <laughs> my son, and the girls with at the time, and it was like fucking. Uh, thanks for. Them. Here, these are cold. Oh shit! Hell fucking, yeah! Uh, so I went. I went on a three-day cruise, the Carnival cruise. <laughs> that shit was dope, dog. Hell yeah! And then to end it on the third day, you're in Mexico. Yeah. And you got these big ass like uh, oysters with ceviche on top, fresh Fuck for like yeah. two dollars, seven for two dollars. Fire! The dog. beers are fifty cents. Shout it's out like, to Mexico. You're like, what dog. the fuck? And then at the end, I was I sent my mom and my son back to the cruise, and I took my my girl at the time. We're like, right, let's go party, let's go party. So we went to a bar. They're like, all right, what do you guys want? Like, oh, we have an hour before we gotta get back on the cruise. We're like, all right. For 40 bucks, we'll give you guys two buckets of beers and 20 shots. You're down or what? Yeah. I was like, yeah. fuck yeah. yeah that's that so for 45 shit, yeah. minutes, we were just had to down all these shots, drink yeah. all the beers. Hey, we don't have we have too many beers. You give them to the bartender. You yep. give them to the guy that gave you the deal. Hell yeah. You're just right there pounding Fire. it. Fire. Yeah, shout out shit, Mexico, dog. dog. And people might say, like, why don't you go back then? Bitch, if I could, I would. You know what I mean? But I, this, this, yeah, we my, got this is where I get paid at right here, dog. But This is where we grew up. Shout out. Yeah, this is where we grew up. <laughs> fucking Ensenada holds my heart like dearly. You know what I mean? I think my first official peda was in Ensenada, bro. Oh, yeah. Talk about Ensenada. You go to like, a, what do they call Papa's and Beer and shit or what? Nah, I've never been to Papa's and Beer before. You see, we, but, we cast food. You know but what I've been, I've been, I've been there's, a, there's a camping site in Ensenada called La Jolla. And we, my family, we've been there millions of times. And that's just you've fine. been with your family, not like to go party with the homies. Nah, we went one nah, time nah. together. I went one time with the homies, and I will never do it again. Nah. Really, it depends who you go with. Dog. Yeah, the, I went with my homies. <laughs> I was there. If you have homies that like Cali Palo, it's scary. Nah, oh, no, yeah. it was We're scary about to get because shot, we're gonna get kidnapped. Nah, no, you went with it the was, mix of homies. It bro. was it was the worst because it was the opposite of that. We were just doing like everything. Boring shit. No, doing everything, bro. Like, first of all, we showed up there. It was <sighs> dead. I don't even want to talk about this story. And then we ended up getting really drunk. I ended up getting jacked for a backpack that had all my shit in it. It was a bad experience, but the best times was when and I went with my birthday. family. Bro. That shit was hilarious. I went to the. I went to a look. Well, we went during the pandemic to go donate like five hundred sleeping bags, a thousand boxes of pizza, clothes to to these like oh, people dope. who came from like El Salvador. Who yeah, got stuck yeah, at the border. La, la caravana. Yeah, so yeah, they yeah. got stuck at the border and they're living under a freeway. So yeah, one time I was on a sick one. And it was like five in the morning. And I'm like, I got an idea. We have to go save these people. And then back back then I was part of a real estate. I was doing real estate. Right, right here in Downey. So I hit up all my rich homies, all my homies who wanted to get in. Say, hey, we need to go fucking buy every single backpack and fucking sleeping bag from Big Five. Yeah. And in two weeks, fool, we got a shitload of shit. I bet. And then we fucking took like eight cars down their way. We went down there. We fucking made them all file line. We gave them money. We gave them backpacks, pizza, all little kids. We gave them toys and shit. And then at the end, we're like, all right, 
Now it's time to party. Now it's time to party, <laughs> dog. So let me go to fucking um, Hong Kong uh, and shit. Puerto Nuevo. Oh, oh sick. Yeah. And we get lobster, fresh lobster. It was my birthday. So I was getting bottles. We we're getting fucking stupid faded. And it, there's nothing like going to Mexico and having a good time getting drunk, eating lobster. Because if oh, you're, you're, you're like in your home, the motherland. But you just donated all this shit. Saw all these people yeah. who were super happy. And then you're getting faded, bro. Yeah. That's a feeling that I can't even describe to you. That's great. So then we're all fucking faded. And we're like, all right, let's go home. Like, nah, let's go to fucking downtown TJ. Let's, yeah. Let's La to, Revo. Let's go to Hong Kong, my boy. Yeah. So we're in Hong Kong for like I'll be down 14 right more hours. Oh, hey. Speaking of that Eating place, Chinese food. All right, oh, may, maybe we'll tell you the story on your Patreon, dog. Oh, look, okay, let's let's say that story for the Patreon. Uh, yeah, you know what I'm talking about. Yeah, I'm all right, right, right the corporate. This I'm is so great. You guys better subscribe to his Patreon. Subscribe to the yeah. Patreon. If you want to hear the story about Hong Kong? If you don't know what Hong Kong is, you're stupid. Trust me, you want to know? You'll figure it out.